All right, everybody, we're back. And uh, today we're going to be messing around with the Project Pegasus lane. So there's a lot of different iterations and uh, I'm probably going to try to build out a couple more things uh, because this lane is so much fun. I, it's the finally they release a pro player lane and it's ridiculous the amount of things that you can do. They're kind of endless. Um, but uh, I don't know if it's just because I just got this new Onslaught variant or what's going on, um, but I really wanted to put something together with this. And if you know Onslaught Citadel, then you know Onslaught on Onslaught Citadel is kind of ridiculous. But what if you can make your own Onslaught Citadel, aka Mystique? So <laughs> um, with this, if you can pull into Project Par oh, if you can luck out and one of the lanes does turn into um, Project uh, Pegasus early, um, turn one or two, you can drop Onslaught, followed by Mystique, which essentially gives you two Onslaughts on a lane. And then you run your Omega, your Iron Man, or your Mr. Fantastic. I mean, Mr. Fantastic in a lane uh, alone, even without Omega, he pushes 16 into into both the other lanes, which is pretty fun to do. Um, so I kind of just built this out real quick. Um, I, I have a, another deck list if you'd like to see it on the channel. Uh, I ran some I ran some games with that, um, and it's an onslaught style deck list as well, running Omega. Um, I, I will say that even that one needs a little bit of tweaking, but uh, this one I did pull a couple things out mainly because um, because of the of what we're trying to do right now. Um, it's really this is kind of just built in mind with uh, uh, Project Pegasus. Um, we just we're, we're literally just trying to get down onslaught as soon as possible. Uh, copy him with Mystique and then uh, run our madness from there. Um, but uh, that means that on the early turns, or even, I guess later you can, um, drop Ant-Man, Sunspot, um, uh, Mojo, Armor. Armor's here to protect our Sunspot. He's here to protect um, basically all our low-cost cards in Ebony Maw and Sunspot. And then Adam Warlock and Ebony Maw. So uh, if nobody else is running this, um, I really like running this combo together. I know a lot of people do Adam Warlock followed by... Um, some kind of gotcha card in a uh, like a Gru or a Star Lord or something to kind of get them. Um, but I just personally just like dropping Ebony Maw into a Adam Warlock on turn three. Uh, typically, they don't have seven power by that point to uh, compete with you. And if it's a lane that they haven't even played anything into, and you've already dropped down like an Ant Man or a Mojo or an Armor into that lane. Or a sunspot. Sunspot's great uh, for that lane because if you do need him to get larger, he can. Uh, since Ebony Maw will be locking it out, I don't have a zero yet, so I can't throw that in quite yet. Uh, but you do that nonsense, and then you get your draws because this deck really just wants to draw into its combo sources. Um, so Ant Man, obviously, he does get bigger if you need him in the onslaught lane. Barely do it. Um, uh, this deck could use it could be modified in a million different ways. Um, the main points uh, here are your Omega, your Iron Man, your Onslaught, and your Mystique. Uh, actually, Mr. Fantastic is amazing in here. You can also sub in Claw for like magic or, or do things with that as well. Um, I will say a uh, that would all, it would be a fantastic uh, thing to switch magic out with. Uh, I just like magic in here in case we do need to push into a later, into the later rounds of the game um, to try to either pull our Iron Man or our Onslaught. Um, Iron Man is going to be essential. Like if you don't have Iron Man, it's going to be rough um, because of the Omega Red um, ongoing effect of he needs to be winning in that lane by plus 10 to push plus 4 into each other lane. So you really need all of the power you can get. So that's why Iron Man is essential in here. And then, like I said, the rest of the cards, uh, Ebony Maw, Adam Warlock are amazing in just uh, trying to get your combos. So in a lot of decks that you're looking to combo off of, uh, I've noticed a lot of people will be running Adam Warlock. I enjoy it as well. Um, it's just uh, there's not much, um, there really isn't any other card draw in the game. So you really need that, uh, that card draw that uh, Adam Warlock provides. Uh, Mojo, he's just great. Sometimes you can uh, push out some wins with uh, Mojo since he does get larger in the lane. And if he's in the lane with Onslaught, it, 
again gets ridiculous um and armor like i said protects mystique like i said in this deck uh specifically running the project pegasus uh playing into the project pegasus lane um you really want to copy onslaught uh, Mr. Fantastic, uh, like I said, he goes down after all of it, and he will get um, he will push 16 into each other lane. Um, Omega gets giant as well. Iron Man, like I said, he's going to be pushing the power into uh, to get Omega above the plus 10 in that lane. Uh, Magic, like I said, uh, really just in there in case we haven't pulled into like our Iron Man or or our Omega. And then Onslaught is the heart of the deck with his ongoing, double your other ongoing effects. So um, when you have Onslaught down, he's going to double like your Omega, your Mr. Fantastic, your Iron Man. Um, all of that's going to get doubled. And if you have Mystique copying Onslaught, Onslaught Citadel. So <laughs> let's jump into a couple games and uh, see what we can do. Okay. Wow, Apple. Let's... See if we can pull into everything. Okay, this is good actually. This is great actually. This is this is as about about as good as we could ask for. Um, where do we play our onslaught? Um, I'm just gonna play it into the left lane. I feel like with Project Pegasus, everybody plays into that lane immediately. And yeah, yep. Um, we're gonna actually hold off until turn three to drop our Mystique. At this point, um, if we could get either, okay, we don't want that happening to us. That's so unfortunate. I really want to drop Ebony Maw. Um, we're just not gonna have the the ability to do so. Because um, on turn three, we're gonna drop Mystique. Unless there's an <laughs> another Project Pegasus, I wouldn't mind that. You'd be able to drop all this. Interesting that they pass turn. I wonder why. Okay, now we're gonna Mystique here. And turn. Um, we really just need our... Either our... It's also an interesting play. Um, to make the monster that big. Um, we need our Omega Red or our Mr. Fantastic to now push a lot of power out. Um, I could do something like this, this, and this. Yeah, I don't really want uh, to risk anything of anything getting pushed out of here and into here. We need, come on, I actually an Adam Warlock right there would have been great so that we could have drawn another card. Okay, Kazar. Definitely not a bad time for Kazar. This lane's gonna go to ridiculous amounts of power right now. I'm um, just on six. It's gonna, <laughs> it's gonna skyrocket. That's a very interesting play because I have a sunspot in there. I am Iron Man. Interesting. Yep, that's gonna get pushed out over here. Nothing can move here. 1500 power in this left lane i'm already winning it i i win the game there's there's nothing they can do right i'm still gonna do this and push just so you guys can see how much power this pushes with just mr fantastic now imagine if we had uh, omega red because this is only gonna push two here doubling it a fun amount of times And even lower as if we needed the lizard to go down anymore as well <laughs> okay that explains uh some of this but look 16 <laughs> 2048 and 16 here <laughs> so we went all three lanes that's great actually bots will usually somehow take the game from you i'm surprised they didn't have an enchantress a rogue something to stop us here Do our our hellos. Okay, we have a turn one drop. We have Mystique. We have Omega. Oh, please, 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 please. You know, sometimes you ask nicely. Oh, that's amazing. Okay, so let's see if we can pull off all the shenanigans. We do unfortunately have to skip turn two. 
Um, but we can. Oh, please don't steal something good. Please don't steal our Iron Man. Please. Come on. Hopefully those that was. Are you kidding me? The the one turn we get everything we need. Art. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? That's absolutely brutal. Okay. This is tough. Um, we just have nothing. So they did take our mojo. They took everything from us. I mean, we have two onslaughts on the board technically. It's just not exactly what we wanted to see from them. We're just gonna push some power here into the middle lane and hopefully they didn't take our Iron Man. If they took our Iron Man, this game's basically over. Um, oh no, okay, so they took our Mr. Fantastic. Okay, not terrible. We just need to pull into Iron Man now. This, the one thing this game needs is a mode that doesn't that relies so much on all this RNG. If I didn't have Omega in hand, I would have been terrified right now, thinking they stole it. Okay, so this is great. Let's see. And if they don't play anything in here, let's see how much power they push into Kiln. We might not even want to. Tr Hopefully, we get something good on our last. Um, our last card maybe ant-man that'd be awesome actually push all that extra power actually they they capped it out and we don't want them to get any power from the mojo we win <laughs> we just skip turn here <laughs> uh, sunspot's gonna go up by six um they can't they can't compete in the far left lane um if you are a bot i'm gonna snap at you and uh, yeah, take that for stealing our cards. <laughs> Victory! Uh, <laughs> I hate snapping because they always leave when you snap. And I, I like to see these, uh, especially when it's a win, I like to see it play out. I don't need the cubes or anything, I just want to see it play out. Yeah. So our hellos. Ooh, Project Pegasus? Turn one? Oh, Subterranea. And we are guaranteed at least. Four rocks. Count now. One. Okay. Not terrible. Drop mojo. Let's see, okay, Sentinel. Hmm. Trying to think of what they're running here. Um, I don't see any, uh, okay. Okay, we got something. Do we drop, do we risk um, coming out here with our onslaught? Armor, onslaught. Um, reason being is we're probably not even gonna get the mojo trigger and I need the space for, if we can get Mystique, Actually, yeah, yeah, Mystique, uh, Iron Man, and Omega. That would be great. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, this is, uh, that's fine. Not worried about that at all. Uh, I really hope we can get a Mystique here, though. Mystique, come on. Skip turn. I'm gonna skip. We have magic in hand, so uh, we can extend the game if needed. Oh man. At least they got one. Maybe waiting was a. Uh... Waiting was the right call. We might not even need 
do we just build this up for funsies? I'm gonna hold off. I, I, I really don't want to put the rocks in there. I'm gonna hold off, but we can fill this up for funsies um, if needed, um, just to get the mojo trigger. And I mean, it's uh, probably on the sense. Oh, saber tooth. Okay, we, we win this if we just uh, put the rocks in there. I'm not worried about that at all. Yeah, we can even just do an you know, om. Actually, do Omega doesn't get us large enough. We can do. Struggling. <laughs> Struggling. <laughs> okay, we can do a Mr. Fantastic. And then we can do the Rock. And the Rock um, guarantees us here. Mr. Fantastic will push a lot of power here. Uh, check this out. Uh, and that's a. Uh, every card they put in there gets negative one. Um, we don't have to worry about that since we're not technically putting cards in there. Mr. Fantastic will do all the work for us. 16. I mean, come on. 16 with Mr. Fantastic. That's great. That is great. <laughs> Just pull out the win by one, but a win's a win. <laughs> and with the two rocks. We only got two, so better than the average. We'll take it. We'll take right, it. Hungry Hulk. Let's see what you got. See if you have what it takes against the Onslaught. Ooh, real person? Real person finally? Thumbs up. Okay, one, two, and three cost cards can't be played there kind of unfortunate because if we do get project pegasus and want to do the um onslaught mystique uh, nonsense this could be good okay we like this let's just hope nothing uh gets in the way of this Why are they not playing anything right one right this glitch is so <laughs> frustrating okay should be good this should be good okay they play two cards what do they play iron, iron man there iron man. and not into onslaught citadel okay that makes sense i am iron man okay, well we're gonna have one here too um we just need to try and win by a significant amount of power now. See if we can do it. We. I don't know if we're going to be able to compete over here, um, but hopefully we can here. Okay, Mr. Negative deck. Um, so. Yeah, let's just uh, lock that in. I don't see any reason to... Well, we can't, actually. Uh, Crimson Cosmos. Just a casual 2,000 power. 28 here and 16 here. I don't think we extend the game. Um, we try to win it. I don't know if they cap this out. That's the only issue here. Um, if they can push power into this middle lane say we risk it i i don't think we give them another turn uh mr negative every turn you give them is terrifying i mean they already have their iron man but uh, it's still terrifying See how confident they are let's, uh, let's test their confidence come on what are we thinking do it do it do it <laughs> I wonder if they're calculating everything, I'm trying to see. Problem is, do they, uh, they leave? Yeah. Yeah. yeah they <laughs> Victory. Onslaught Citadel with Onslaught is disgusting. And I don't predict he had that in this deck. Uh, he's running Mr. Negative. Uh, there's no way he had that. Um, so he could have gotten a large amount of power, um, but Onslaught with Iron Man on Onslaught Citadel is 
it's it's kind of crazy. Good way. Hello. By the way, I did get an avatar. I got Mojo. Might be throwing that on. I've been getting a lot of luck from the the caches. Uh, I swear they uh, they've been giving me all kinds of luck. Ooh, we like this. Okay, do. See if we can, uh, okay, so Invisible Woman, we're thinking it's going to be some type of um, Ella nonsense. I'm actually fine with, with this deck, if we can get it all to work out, I have no issues with that. Even like this, um, I have no issues if we can just get Iron Man Onslaught here. Um, typically it's not a gigantic amount of power here, the power is going to be in these two lanes. Let's see if we can uh, pull something out. Okay, I like that. I just wish we had... We can do Omega. We need Iron Man. We really need Iron Man. Okay, this lane's gonna be pretty large. I'm guessing they have... Uh... Okay, so we have Iron Man. We can... I don't know if we extend the game. I don't think so, right? Um... Yeah, we need him down to be able to push the power high enough here. Because um, this is the lane we're going to be competing in. They waited a while to play into this lane, which is uh, interesting. They're going to push a lot of power here, but... Um, it's... No? Are, are they really going to... There's no way they stick this out, right? They got rid of Hela. There's just absolutely no way with... Yeah. <laughs> I was waiting, I was trying to count down, like, I was waiting for that. Let's see, what, let's see if we can pull into everything. Um, let's see if uh, Project Pegasus... Okay, one energy is not terrible, I'll take it. Uh, we can drop armor on turn one, which I don't mind. Okay, we have a lot of what we need in hand. Um, we just need... This could get good. I mean, we don't even... I mean, we would like to have Onslaught, but we don't need him with uh, Onslaught Citadel. He basi that's basically Onslaught, so... <laughs> Let's see if we can make something happen here. it would be good. Fortunately, we have a skip. We have nothing for two. Onslaught, 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 terrible, but we can do this, and this, yeah, those two, we just need Onslaught now, there's going to be a lot of power, we're going to push into uh, both of these lanes if we can manage getting our Onslaught, uh, because we're going to drop Omega here, and then Onslaught here, and yeah, that's insane amount of power to push across the board <laughs> I like this next turn uh, we can try to fill up this one uh, just to secure this lane as well but <laughs> this is gonna get good Okay, he miss. Bishop, okay. Rocket, yeah, that's fine. Not phased at all right now. <laughs> this is gonna get ugly. That was just boom. Boom. Oh, I wish I had something else to uh, cap that off, but we'll just take the power. Since we're not even gonna get the cap, I'm just gonna throw. Uh, two extra power over here. Maybe we need it. I don't think so. <laughs> we 
w watch these numbers right now. <laughs> As long as the bot does not uh, back out, it should be fun. Okay, I'm very happy we didn't put our Ant-Man over here now. You guys ready? <laughs> the <laughs> Onslaught Citadel, Onslaught, Iron Man, it, it's... <laughs> Basically unfair. You know, just a casual 3,000, 50, and uh, 52. <laughs> I think that's the perfect game to end it with. I think uh, we're gonna call it with that one. Um, the project Pegasus. All right, some closing thoughts. Um, this deck is a lot of fun when everything does work. Uh, as you've seen in a couple of games, if we get Onslaught Citadel out with all of this madness already, it's quite insane. And then the games that you don't, and you just get Project Pegasus, you have Onslaught Citadel with uh, Mystique already. So if you can get all of it to work together in Onslaught and then Mystique, and then copying your Omega or your Mr. Fantastic. Omega's, he's a little harder to pull off if you don't have your Iron Man. <clears throat> so you really need the Iron Man play with Omega. Which really means that if you're going to be playing the Onslaught Mystique route, uh, you're going to need to have omega down by turn four um it, it, so it gets a little rough trying to squeeze it all in uh but it's a lot of fun when it works as you've seen in a couple of those games the power output is insane uh you don't even need to play into the other lanes um you really just need to get the combo uh and and this deck's just really for fun it, it's just for fun with uh, the new lane that's currently going around and so i uh, give it a shot i am most of these cards you will have in onslaught in um, Iron Man in Mr. Fantastic. Um, so if you are one of the lucky ones who has pulled a Mystique already in your pull three ventures, uh, you can make some stuff happen. Uh, you don't need Omega. If you have Claw, Claw is great for it as well. Um, or even just in the games that you run into um, Onslaught Citadel, if you don't have Mystique and you're just running Claw, it's great. Um, uh, I can build out a different iteration of just a casual, not, I wouldn't say casual, a deck that does work, I would say. Um, but doesn't require onslaughts. I uh, doesn't require um, Project Pegasus. We can also do that. Take a look and things like that. Um, let me know what you guys think. Uh, drop your drop your thoughts, your comments, and um, I'd love to see what kind of decks you guys are currently building in uh, this new lane, which is so much fun. It's so insane. Um, the amount of things that we're going to be able to do with this is quite ridiculous. Um, I hope that they keep pushing more uh, pro player. Um, uh, lanes out. It, it's just so much fun. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think and uh, we'll see you in the next one.